Hey guys, welcome back to Moneo Pura. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I make my fenugreek hairspray. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. To make this hairspray, you're going to need a digital scale and a beaker to measure out our ingredients. So what we're going to do, we're going to add 25 grams of fenugreek seed to the beaker. And then we're going to add 200 grams of distilled water to the beaker. Preferably, it's good to use distilled water because we want this um, hairspray to be able to last longer and we don't want it to develop any bacteria um, while we are using it on our hair. But if you don't have distilled water, you can use purified water um, or filtered water. Now all you have to do is cover the beaker or the container that you are making this um, recipe in cover it with a cling film and let it set overnight or for 24 hours by doing this it will allow for the fenugreek seed to be able to infuse the water and it's the water that has been infused with the fenugreek seed that we're going to be using to make our fenugreek hairspray once you have allowed this to be able to set overnight your fenugreek seed and the water should look something like this um, the water should be a lot thicker um, and the fenugreek seed should have swelled a little bit as well and doubled in size so remove the cling film and now it's time for us to make our fenugreek hairspray so we need to bring back our digital scale for us to be able to weigh out our ingredients in percents and in grams so that the preservative that we're going to be using would be able to preserve the hairspray for the length of time that we're going to be using it for. So choose a container of your choice. I am using um, a 100 ml um, glass bottle. I will be making 100 ml or 100 grams of my hairspray. Now what I'm going to do now is measure out the fenugreek water. So I'm going to be adding to the glass bottle 97 grams of that fenugreek liquid. Once you've added the 97 grams of the fenugreek liquid into our glass bottle, making sure that the seed um, does not get into the bottle. Once that is done, then we need to add the rest of the ingredients to make this hairspray. So add 0 0.5 grams of rosemary essential oil. That is the oil that I prefer and it's a really good oil for um, hair growth. And then add 0 0.5 grams of lavender oil, another good essential oil for our hair. Now what we're going to do is because oil and water do not mix, we're going to be adding one gram of polysorbate 80 to allow us to be able to bind the oil and water together. Because I don't really like shaking my hairspray every time I use it. I want everything to be combined and ready for use. But you don't have to use the polysorbate 80. Um, all you have to do is every time you want to use the hairspray, you just shake the bottle and then use the spray. And to preserve our hairspray, we need to add a preservative. So the preservative that I'm using is Preservative Eco. And the manufacturing requirement for this preservative is 1%. So I'm going to be using 1 gram of our preservative to make sure that my hairspray is preserved and does not grow any bacteria or fungal in this because we are using water after all and once that is done give it a really good shake and it should change to this beautiful creamy color and your fenugreek hairspray is done i hope you've enjoyed this video if you have 
hit the subscribe button and the notification bell next to it so that you are notified when we do upload more videos if you're not already following us on our instagram head over to our instagram as well and follow us on our instagram we also sell hair and skincare products over on etsy and on our website um, i will leave all the details in the description box below um, i'll leave the recipe as well in percents and also in grams in the description box below so make sure that you check it out if you want to make this hairspray and if you do make the hairspray take a picture and tag us on instagram and we would also reshare the post as well so until next time i will see you guys in the next video bye